What's your relationship with cash flow? Are you spending money or are you investing it? That's what I'm going to talk about in today's Weekday Wisdom. Hi, this is Karma Spence, the Own Your Awesome Mentor, with another clip of a Facebook Live that I've done in which I talk about the third trait of successful entrepreneurs, and that is their understanding of cash flow. Basically, successful hobbypreneurs understand that there's cash flow. They understand it. Now, by understanding cash flow, I don't mean that they know how to do Excel spreadsheets or Quicken or any of that accounting stuff. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking bigger picture here. What I'm talking about is that money comes and it goes, and that's a good thing. So, for example, people with a employee mindset tend to think of income and expenses. They spend their money when it goes out. Whereas entrepreneurs and hobbypreneurs who are successful think of income and investment. They don't spend their money. They invest it. They also do that with their time. They don't spend time. They invest it. And this is the key. Because when you think about spending money, you're just thinking about, oh, I'll buy an ice cream, I'll consume it, it's gone. You're not thinking about any return on that spending. You're just buying something. You're buying your utilities. You're buying your dinner. You're buying things. You're spending money. Whereas entrepreneurs invest. They expect a return on any money they spend. So when they invest in utilities, they are investing in their own comfort. They invest their time. Do I want to do this specific task? Will it help me in some way? And I don't mean it's always all about business investments. Sometimes you're investing in yourself. Sometimes, do I want to invest this money because it will give me a return on my investment in business assets or because it'll make me feel better? So here's another example. With these Facebook Lives that I'm doing every day in this Facebook Live challenge, I could think of it as, oh, I'm just wasting my time just for the challenge. But I just decided not to do it that way. I decided to invest my time in creating assets where I talk about what I do in my business. And at the same time, I'm serving you. I'm helping you. I'm helping you understand new topics. And I'm also helping myself hone my message because this is a new direction I'm doing for my business. So how do you move yourself from thinking of spending to investing? Well, you just decide to do it for one. I mean, that that may be a try answer, but that's really what it takes. You decide. You start using the word, I'm investing my money in this ice cream right now because it'll make me feel good. I'm investing my money in this class because it'll help me do X better. I'm investing my time in watching this Facebook Live because Karma's going to give me some really cool information that will help me in my business. Change your words. It'll change your mindset. And if you start thinking more in terms of investing than spending, understanding that cash flow goes out, and that's a good thing because sometimes when cash goes out, more comes back, then you've made the leap from an entrepreneurial mindset to an entrepreneurial mindset. I hope you enjoyed that clip. This is Karma Spence, the Own Your Awesome Mentor, reminding you to not box yourself in, spread your wings and fly you. Yes, you are capable of more than you know. If you enjoyed this video, comment below. If you have questions you'd like me to answer in future videos, comment below. Let me know what you think about today's episode, previous episodes, or even just ideas for future episodes. I really do want to hear from you because I want the Weekday Wisdom to be something that you value and look forward to watching.